An exciting new procedure is being performed here on campus that can help ailing dogs walk again. Pavel Kaufman joins us now to give us the story in our health and environment segment. Pavel, what's up? Thanks, guys. Well, there's an 11-year-old yellow Labrador retriever named Jake who's part of a groundbreaking procedure, and it was done right here at the MSU Veterinary Clinic. Here's Jake's story. Six months ago, Jake couldn't have gotten up or down the stairs. At first, we thought it was just old age, um, but then it um, got to the point where we were starting to think something was really wrong. Jake was suffering from elbow arthritis, a crippling injury for dogs since they put a great deal of their body weight on their front legs. Jake's only options at the point of the time that the elbow replacement surgery was available was to either amputate the leg to remove the source of the pain or to put him to sleep because of the pain he was in. And so Jake was a perfect candidate to be the first dog in the Midwest to have a cementless elbow prosthesis implanted a procedure that would improve Jake's quality of life or even save it. But after we came here and actually talked to Dr. Desjardins, we were so impressed with the, the device itself and with him uh, that we decided right away that that's what we wanted to do. Using a prosthesis developed by Randy Acker, a veterinarian from Idaho, MSU's own Dr. Loic Desjardins implanted the device into Jake's elbow in April. So this new design actually is uh, very uh, interesting in concept. Uh, not only in design itself, but also the way it is implanted is, uh, is uh, very uh, top-notch, uh, cutting-edge technology. Jake's surgery was done right here at the MSU Veterinary Hospital. It's one of four institutions to offer this elbow prosthesis. So even if we preserve or, or if we still have post-operatively some uh, lameness, residual lameness, the important thing for us is that the dog is pain-free. With the procedure being so new, Jake was only the 11th dog in the world to have this done. But the surgery is just the first step, as Jake's rehabilitation of the elbow is a critical time. What I did when he first came in was we put him in the water, in the underwater treadmill, to the point of his shoulder so that he would only be bearing 38% of his own body weight. Jake goes through extensive physical therapy, from being in the water, walking up and down steps, or just simply going outside for walks. Being in good health before the surgery is a big reason why he is doing so well after it. His spine, his hips, his knees, everywhere are very nice healthy joints to work with so that we could do the surgery on the elbow and not expect something else to fail in his body. And now six months after surgery, Jake is pain free and full of life. Since Jake, five other dogs have gotten the elbow prosthesis done at MSU and, in, and interest continues to grow.